Hey, Instant Potheads, another episode of Kong Can Cook. Now I'm in a hurry. I got home late from work today, and we don't know what to do for dinner. So if you're in the same situation, you're gonna really appreciate today's one pot pasta. I'm calling it pepperoni pasta because the kids love pepperoni and they love pasta. So we can do pepperoni pasta real quick in the Instant Pot. Let me show you how. As always, make sure that everything is lubricated while you're cooking. So we're gonna do that first. Mm -mm. Step two, put your Instant Pot on saute. Today, Lionel here is helping me out. Hello! Hello! Is it me you're looking for? That's right, Lionel Richie in the house. He's my Instant Pot. Now that we got saute mode on, splash of oil, half an onion diced up. So, to, while the onions are sweating, we're gonna add in two cloves worth of garlic. About a pound of ground beef right in there, right? Hey, if you happen to have one of those handy dandy fancy schmancy hamburger chopper uppers, you know, the thing that looks like a uh, propeller blade on a stick, use that. I'm sure it works really well. I don't have one yet, hint, hint, but you can use those if you do have one. If you don't, uh, this little wooden spatula works fine for me. So. Beef got brown. It's only been a minute and a half, so we're right on schedule to make our super fast pasta for tonight. Next step, season really well. A little salt, a little pepper. Next step, one box of pasta, 16 ounces, one pound. Completely dry. And go right on top. One can of your favorite pasta sauce. This one happens to be mine. You use whichever one happens to be yours. I got a 24 ounce can right here. I'm gonna pour this on the top and try to keep it floating on top of the pasta. I don't want it to go all the way down to the bottom and there's a reason for this. See, the pasta sits on top because if it gets down to the bottom, if there's a chance it'll scorch. We're trying not to use a lot of water. We don't want watery pasta here today. So if we can leave it sitting on top, and then I'm gonna pour this water around the side to make sure that it can get down to the bottom. One can of water in there. Next step, got our lid. Make sure the vent is set to sealing. One of the most beautiful sounds in the world. <coughs> Excuse me. Make sure you do this. And then you're gonna do this. Off. Manual. Seven minutes. It'll be done in seven minutes. Now, I like seven minutes because we like our pasta a little bit soft. If you prefer a more al dente uh, pasta, something with a little tooth, a little bite to it, uh, I would suggest probably five or six, depending on how you like it done. Typically, you're gonna do it for half of the time that it says on the package uh, to cook it for. Al dente in seven to eight minutes. So I guess you could cook it for four uh, or less to have al dente, but we like it soft, so seven minutes it is for us. See you back here in seven minutes. We've released the pressure. Everything should be cooked beautifully. Let's take a peek inside, all right? Oh, goodness, look at this. Now, I don't know if you can see all this, but pasta is nice. This is done the way we like it. It might be a little bit soft uh, for some people. Uh, this really is 
This really is just how we like it. Now, you can add another can of sauce at this point if you like it saucy. If you don't like it saucy, here's what you do. Next step, you're gonna take a cup of cheese. I only have a little less than a cup. I'm gonna use what I got. Nice amount of mozzarella right here. Top of that, half a bag of uh, pepperoni here. Okay, stay lubed because we're all done. Stir this in and you're ready to serve. Fantastic dinner uh, on any day when you happen to come home late and you don't know what to make. Here you go, pepperoni pasta. Now we're gonna go in for the taste. Smells delicious, it's saucy, it's cheesy, it's pepperoni. What's there not to like, right? Mmm. Mmm. This is how we like it, mushy. The sauce has penetrated into the pores of your noodle, and you can taste it in every bite. It's just delicious. I hope you enjoyed this quick episode of Kong Can Cook. We got dinner done. Everybody's gonna be happy. If you like the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you like this channel, go ahead and subscribe. It'll let you know every time a new video comes out. Okay, everybody, stay lubed. I love you, Instant Potheads. Here's to you. And to Lionel, to Lionel. Catch you later. Hello.